Welcome to Kirche Poland for MSPO 2015. This yearly event is now recognized as one of the leading European defense exhibition after Eurosatory and DSCI, and definitely the leading one in Central Europe. Today we are faced with a fundamentally changed security environment and it will have long-term consequences. It will have consequences for our stability. Russia has shown will and ability to use military force to achieve their strategic aims. And in Europe's southern neighborhood, we see an extremely worrying development in Syria and Iraq, as well as in Maghreb and Sahel. This instability threatens and affects not only the region, but Europe as well. Poland recently launched several procurement programs and this is noticeable at this year's MSPO. One of them is the Krug Combat Helicopter Program. American company Boeing features for the first time an AH-64 Apache helicopter. More than 2100 Apaches have been delivered to customers around the world. It has been combat proven in Afghanistan, Iraq and Libya. Another helicopter being showcased for the first time in Poland is the T-129 attack by Turkish Aerospace Industries. Based on the Italian Agusta A-129 Mangusta, the T-129 is used by the Turkish Army. It already conducted counter-terrorism in Turkey. Airbus Helicopters is showcasing a Tiger HAD combat helicopter from the French Army. Over 120 Tiger helicopters have been delivered to France, Germany, Spain and Australia. Following deployment in Afghanistan and Libya, the Tiger is currently supporting combat missions in Mali. Airbus helicopter also brought an H-145M multirole light helicopter, as well as an H-225M Caracal. Poland recently selected the Caracal as its future transport helicopter and Airbus Helicopters is currently in final stages of negotiations for the contract. Polish Armed Forces is also seeking procurement of several types of UAVs, including the Zephyr program, which calls for 12 male UKEV, and the Grief program, which calls for 12 tactical male UAVs. 
As a consequence, Israeli company Herbit Systems is showcasing the Hermes 900. It is already used by Israel, Chile, Colombia, Mexico, and has been ordered by Brazil and Switzerland. Thales is featuring its watchkeeper. It is an I-Star UAV already in use with the British Army and is being considered by other countries including France. Another procurement program for Poland is Orca, which calls for two diesel submarines capable of launching long-range cruise missiles. French company DCNS is offering the Scorpion with MBDA's naval cruise missile while German company TKMS is offering its Class 212A submarine potentially fitted with Tomahawk cruise missile.